safeguard and develop this facility. It is an international standard, standard facility. It is available and accessible for the community. And it's essential through the partnership between college and house of sport, safeguard the facility, ensure it remains available for the community. I'm delighted to be here today and fantastic that we've got the weather with us as well. So we've been able to really see the wide range of sports facilities that we've actually got on this site and the huge amount of demand that there is uh, for them. Clearly we want to provide a centre for education and training that attract those youngsters who perhaps fell out of love with learning, but not just academic education <coughs> for the sake of learning, but as a progression route into work and skills. And if we want youngsters to go into sport, then we have to make sure they've got the facilities in this city. And I'm determined to make sure that we explore every single type of partnership to make sure that the assets we already have and those assets that we need in the future uh, absolutely are in place for, for people that want to engage and uh, enjoy sport. Our experience from running House of Sport taught us that for, for sport to thrive, it has to be linked to education and community. And it also has to be flexible enough to coexist with other sports. And whether it's community sport in competitive leagues, or whether it's projects like you'll be aware of Park Run, trying to get participation <coughs> in sport. So that we embrace many of the great organisations, much of the fantastic work that's already taken place <coughs> in the city, so that we can help you more uh, to deliver more with, um, with less resources. So thank you very much.